The Vatican's permanent observer to the United Nations in Geneva reinforced the Pope's official stance on the Palestinian-Israeli conflict, calling for an immediate ceasefire to the fighting. In the long run, there can be no winners in the current tragedy, only more suffering. Most of the victims are civilians who by international humanitarian law should be protected. Archbishop Tomasi did not place blame on other side for the escalation in the latest conflict. However, he described as intolerable the high number of Palestinian civilian deaths, as well as the rockets fired indiscriminately at Israelis. Tomasi also invoked the Pope's visit to the Holy Land in May and the prayer for peace in June in calling both sides to dialogue. With violence, men and women will continue to live as enemies and adversaries, but with peace, they can live as brothers and sisters. The Geneva-based UN Human Rights Council convened a special session to discuss the Gaza offensive, but the council is under constant criticism itself. It has passed more resolutions against Israel than all other countries combined, while failing to address other sensitive issues. Critics also denounced the participation in the council of non-democratic countries, accused of commuting human rights abuses themselves. Crimes against humanity.